Hey for all people, how Una day welcome back to Tessis TV. We don't carry another better apropos con give una about waiting the stop for palace. As the Tori where the riches right now from inside the palace of Oni is that Olori Miriam was seen in tears. Olori Miriam is weeping because what she expected Kabiese to do for her. KBSA did not do for her. Like some people would say that KBSA has failed her. Yes. She was thinking that KBSA in this Ologio Festival will make her the queen of all queens. Will make her the Eloa of the souls. She was thinking that she has gotten all the opportunity that she needs. That this one where mommy said in a cow did not attend the Ologio Festival that she will be the one in charge. But Kabiesi announced Queen Naomi live in Olojo Festival. Yes, even though that Queen Naomi wasn't present, Kabiesi still extend his love for Mommy Tedenekau, telling the people of Ilefe Kingdom that one day, one day, one day, Queen Naomi will have her way back to the palace. And we heard that immediately Kabiesi made announcements made the announcement the wedding wellers they started wedding they started crying why would kabiesi talk such a thing that kabiesi did not regard them why would kabiesi make the announcement in their presence you know they were so angry and annoyed as we heard but due to people surrounded them they have to maintain their composure yes so we heard that uh, out throughout this Olajo festival today that happened because we heard that it is going to happen today, it is going to happen tomorrow, it is going to ha happen next tomorrow. Yeah, that is what we heard. Oh, I mean, it is going to happen today and tomorrow. Tomorrow is the last day being the 30th. So she was thinking that ah, today will be the second to the last day that Kaviyesi would do the unthinkable, that when Naomi did not have her way back, that shows that when Naomi is not interested. We all know the reason why Queen Naomi did not appear again. The uncle is giving Kabiese and Queen Naomi the toughest time. Yes. The uncle won't stand in the gap so that he will break every breakable between Kabiese and Queen Naomi. He doesn't want Queen Naomi back to the palace. But he did not ask Queen Naomi whether he wants to return or not. He just made his conclusion. That's when Naomi will not go back. Though we heard that the Elevi elders are seen to the matter and they are willing to this to see the end to the end of it so that uh, they will make their king happy. So this Olojo festival is already a thing of joy. We heard that uh, celebration was ongoing, that Kabiese was happy like Atelona. Kabiese took this Olojo festival this year as a very special one. Because the gods used uh, Adesina and Ademakewa to bless him. What he has been looking for so long, he found on a platter of gold. That is why it is very hard for Kabiesi to allow these children go. We don't even think Kabiesi will do that. He's going to take full custody as we are hearing. Because Kabiesi has pleaded with the gods for a male child. Kabiesi, as we heard, Indo already gave him a child, Adeola, Adewa Miwa, and the other small one, we don't know her name. And he has only one male child, which is Prince Tedinekau. And he kept on praying, begging the gods to intervene in her case, that it is still possible that she will have more sons. And this year, the gods decided to show Kabiesi some love by blessing his auroris with twins, the other one with his son. Though we heard that there are stories behind the children, which we are waiting for the story to unfold very soon. So right now, we heard that Olori Miriam is crying. For those who see Miriam for this Olojo Festival today, she was full of happiness. She was so cheerful. She was greeting. That was before the announcement came. She was doing all this because she thought that the crown of the Yeelua of the source will reach her hand today. 
she was expecting it. That is why she dressed the way she was dressing. She weared her cap and everything. She was so beautiful as we had, waiting for the uh, the crown of uh, Yeyelua of the source to reach her for Kabiesi to announce her. But she was shocked that till this evening, Kabiesi did not announce her as the Yeyelua of the source. She was disturbed, as we heard. She was trying to make her way to Kabies because Kabies did already enter inside as of that time. She tried and forced and forced and she had her way inside. She was asking Kabies questions. What really happened? You have not made the announcement up to now. When are you going to make the announcement? And Kabies was like shocked. Which announcement? Because the last time Kabies uh, made announcement was when she was uh, he was outside. For the Olojo Festival today, that he now announced that Kwenawomi will still be back. So Kabiesi was confused because he doesn't know of any announcement he's going to make. And he asked Olori Miriam to remind her about the announcement. That was when Olori Miriam started letting the cat out of the bag that he got to announce to the Ilefe people that Miriam will take over as the Elua of the souls. That Miriam is the person to wear the crown of the Yaya Lua. My correct people, I beg go, make a greet on her first. Before we carry this better approach, go they go. Good morning, afternoon, evening to you all according to your time. And it's on, we will not take the Kukuma see this video. You are welcome back to Texas TV and we are still on the gist about waiting the sub for Palace. So my wonderful people, back to the matter oh. Miriam, as we heard, was weeping because Kabiesi has disappointed her again. She thought that she will have everything she wants because uh, she is supporting Kabiesi financially in his businesses, in his um, all the businesses that he is doing. He is she is financing Kabiesi, so she thought that because of that, Kabiesi would do whatever she wants. But Kabiesi failed her today when she asked for the Hilua crown. Kabiesi gave her a shocking reply that put her to tears. Kabiesi told her that you cannot have the lower crown. When Naomi is returning back and it is only for Mommy Tendenekawo, you can find any other thing, but for this, you are not getting it. So after uh, Kabiesi told uh, all of the medium all this, she was broken, she was devastated, she wasn't happy as we heard that she's running around to stop whatever it is that uh, Kabiesi is doing about Mami Tedenekawa. My correct people are waiting we here with a sofa for Palace. As alleged, I've been making a try to come out. Drop your comments, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, stay tuned, stay connected. For more updates, we'll be dropping from time to time about waiting the sofa for Palace as alleged.